One of the greatest Lucha Libre stars around. We are about to see high flying exemplified. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from San Diego, California, weighing in at 175 pounds. Brave. You know, WrestleMania is always special for Ray. He became WWE Champion for the first time at WrestleMania 23. An excellent high flyer with an amazing family lineage. But now is looking to make his name at his family's expense. And his opponent from San Diego, California, weighing in at 200 pounds, the NXT Cruiserweight Champion, Dominic Mysterio. It's been very rewarding to watch Dominic Mysterio grow into his own man, to control his own destiny. Well, some would say that Dominic Mysterio these days is walking down a very dark path in his career. Cole, do you realize what a win would mean for this gentleman tonight? Oh my God, you could make your career in one night if you knock off the legend. The legendary Luchador Rey Mysterio is looking fired up, and you can tell this is going to be one of those matches where Rey is going to go 100 miles per hour. I mean, you could put the speedometer away because Rey's going to break it. The big question is, is he going to run right into a brick wall? All we know is Mysterio is going to go at full speed no matter what the situation. And waiting for him across the ring is a confident Dominic Mysterio. It's impressive to see what he's been able to accomplish in his young career. Oh, wow. It is impressive. It's no surprise, Saxton. Here he goes for the win. A defiant kick out after one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Get back here. Leg Larian. Kick to the gut creates separation. Producing a trampling. Oh, what a drop kick. Shoulders down. No time to waste being shocked. You've got to maintain pressure. Close line! Off with their head. Hooked up. DT. Just having grown up watching his dad's matches and being trained by him. Okay, consider that a harsh lesson. Oh! Apparently, this match needed a mud hole. Shit. 
shock. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? Flinged across the way. Ooh! Mysterio with great evasion. He saw it coming. Good timing with that reversal. Looking a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this match has been incredible. And this now is what? going to be spectacular. Avalanche, Bulldog. Good. For the pin and the win. Yes. Three. Now he kicked out. This started as a match. Now it's a test of will. Extending their opponent's arm. Oh. A jumping stop to the gut. And Dominic's confidence being kept in check with that hit. Yeah, no surprise that Ray went full speed on that move. Tilt the world head scissors. Yeah. Drop kick all the way to the floor. Amazing grace from Ray Mysterio. Nothing can slow Whoa. Ray Mysterio down. Flying Marijuana. That's how you impress. So popular is Rey Mysterio looking to get the WWE Universe involved in this match as well. Oh, with authority! Oh! Sent off from the apron! Returning to the ring now. Mysterio telling his opponent no size difference is going to make Rey back down. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. He takes control. And Mysterio <laughs> needed that badly. He's showing it's not time for lying down. It's time for fighting back. Got flipped upside down there. This is a pretty dangerous place to fight. Screens, exposed metal, ledges. So much could go wrong very quickly. Attempting to gain some fuel from the WWE Universe. Drop kick on target. And Mysterio beginning to really be worn down here. Not a bad place to be in, but the longer this goes, the more trouble a superstar exposes the this superstar building incredible momentum. Come on, this is, I don't know how the superstar is doing it. Down and out. He's going for the pin. This could be it. Kick out. Kick out. He kicked out. He kicked out. He actually kicked out. Dominic Mysterio has his opponent in place for the 619. There's that innate lucha style from Mysterio. The adrenaline is flowing in the veins of Dominic now. But is that enough for Dominic? Two count, kicks out, just kicked out. Giving up has never been part of Rey Mysterio's character. Proof positive right there. Will that be the last opportunity? Is there still enough left to these men? Don't do it. Oh, no. Crashing hard. I don't care how bold you are, missing on those kind of maneuvers will send you to a medical facility. A medical attention might be needed out here. That was a nasty landing. There's a snapmare. And a basement drop kick. Nothing uglier than a family going to war with each other. But this match has been a thing of beauty to behold. Uh-oh. Drop 
kick. It hits the mark. The end may be in sight for his opponent here. Yeah, he's got to dig deep and find another win if he wants to stay in the game. showing that they have each other's number. Boom! A forearm smack! Raw drop kick! And we see the attention being put on the torso area. Going forward again. Feed off the WWE Universe. This place is starting to rock. that one. Dominic going up high. He's looking for yet another exclamation mark. That was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Two. And it's Dominic scoring the victory. And here's another glance at these superstars in action. Here is your winner, Dominic Mysterio! I know Dominic wanted this win so badly to defeat his father and show him that he's his own man now, that he's moved onward and upward. At times, this was hard to watch, seeing father and son trading blows, but I gotta say... This is a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, you're likely to see a new champ crowned here tonight. Look who's here! Time for a little twin magic. Bray and Nikki, a dominant team long before the women's tag titles ever existed. But now they plan to make the entire women's tag team division suffer. show why they are the greatest women's tag team in history. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the WWE Women's Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers, Dakota Kai and Io Scott, Damage Control. And their opponents, they are the WWE Women's Tag Team Champions, Nikki and Bree. The Bella Twins!
The WWE Women's Tag Titles are up for grabs here tonight. This is sure to be a momentous match. for the Women's Tag Team Championships in this. This battle with tag team titles on the line looking for tag immortality. It'll be Dakota Kai in the sky. And standing across from them, it's a very tough task with Ray Bell and Nikki Bella. And here's where you got to have the utmost faith in your partner, especially with the gold on the line. Corey, I don't think you would do well in one of these. Uh, I've been a tag team champion, Saxton. Do your freaking research. Bang! Drop kick. Dakota Kai digging down deep, trying to gain some momentum from the WWE Universe. Throws her back in from ringside. The champion's down. The champion's down. Oh, my God. We're going to have a new champion. She kicks out in one. Got to change something up with the pin technique. First with a waistlock takedown. Oh my goodness! Here's a pin for the title. The champ not letting the ref get to two. Not getting a two count at this point has to be frustrating.
late in the match, but somehow has the incomparable power to kick out before the one count. With the tag is Nikki Bella.
his way to the ring from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, Austin Theory. Already so many titles and major wins to this young man's name. the showcase of the Immortals will be bad luck, but Owens has no shortage of WrestleMania moments. Jumped off the WrestleMania sign against Seth Rollins, beat Sami Zayn, gave Logan Paul a stutter. But in perhaps the greatest KO Mania moment, he brought the Rattlesnake out of retirement in the main event of WrestleMania 38. Ladies and gentlemen, the social media icon has arrived. And from Cleveland, Ohio, weighing in at 185 pounds, Logan Paul. You know, we know Logan Paul's taken on some of the top names in boxing and WWE. And he may be big on the internet. Or can he really handle a fight? Why don't you roll in the ring and find out yourself, Saxton? No, I'm good. I'm good right here. Put a little respect on Logan Paul's name. Just one of the many reasons why he is the A-lister. And from Hollywood, California, weighing in at 221 pounds, The Miz! This WrestleMania just became A-list. And The Miz, of course, has had much success in WrestleMania. In fact, remember WrestleMania 27, where The Miz defeated John Cena in the main event? You were in the other main event, Cole, and Miz told me that being at the same WrestleMania as Michael Cole was his greatest honor. That's why we're both awesome. seen Rob Van Dam make WrestleMania history in the past by becoming Mr. Money in the Bank at WrestleMania 22. 
And I'm sure Rob Van Dam has a lot more tricks and surprises up his sleeve here tonight. A man free of bloodlines who still thinks he's pretty oozy. And from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sammy Zayn. The master strategist is at the showcase of the immortals. Or has the strategy actually worked for the master strategist? I mean, Sami Zayn lost to Kevin Owens at WrestleMania, and then the next year, he got slapped by a giant hand and stuck in a mousetrap. I dare say he stole that show that night. So, yes, the strategy worked. WrestleMania track record hasn't won a match, including losing the Intercontinental Championship twice. Yeah, but he's at the showcase of Immortals for revenge, Michael, and that's bad news for the opposition tonight. Don't do that anymore, Saxton. Why not? Certain excitement that a United States Championship match has. It's hard to know now exactly what it is. I know what you mean, Byron, whether defending or challenging for the U.S. title. Superstars seem to go the extra mile. Oh, Double chicken wing. Tiger Suplex. Not the move, not shaken one bit by the presence of his opponent. Zane in the twin.
Tremendous
control here. The swinging neck breaker. Textbook. Shoots it. we've ever seen oh, in WWE. Tough. And you can thank one person for that oh, signing, boy. Byron. Here we go. Stephanie McMahon. I'll tell you, no makes an entrance quite like Oscar. A grand entrance for a grand slam champion. And from Osaka, Japan. Oscar! Well, many would say Oscar had one of the best women's matches in WrestleMania history against the Queen Charlotte Flair. I agree with that point, Saxon, but it still eats at Asuka that her undefeated streak ended that night. Yeah, so guess what? Tonight she can take out her WrestleMania frustrations in over 914 days without a loss in NXT and WWE. Think of all the memorable clashes against Bayley, Charlotte Flair, and Becky Lynch, just to name a few was invincible in NXT, every bit as dominant on Raw and SmackDown. If you look deep into the eyes of Asuka, you can almost see her demise. Already a 
first ballot Hall of Fame career, but her accolades keep on growing. We know Ronda Rousey's mantra to be a true champion is to be better than the competition, even at your worst. She's proven before that those aren't just empty words. It's always empty words until she's able to prove it again, Cole. Corey, you're welcome to tell Ronda that yourself. I'll pass. Appreciate it, though. Yeah, I, uh -oh. she can be setting up for a submission here. The line. This just looks agonizing. Stick and move. You can't just let Ronda grab a hold of you and fold you up like a pretzel. You have to be. This could do it! She breaks the ref's cap. She just will not give up, Cole. Fist directly to the gut. Each competitor showing they've done their homework. in the arm. Not done yet. Into the arm breaker. Hammer lock. Oh! Anything Asuka is trying is being suppressed. It has to be a bit demoralizing for the Empress. Controlling the arm. Oh, and a knee strike.
Ronda Rousey channeling that championship spirit, digging deep inside herself to prove Ronda Rousey with a takedown. Look at his cinch in the armbar. There it is. Ronda Rousey submission special. It's over. She couldn't hang on. There it is. Ronda Rousey is your winner. A lot of action in that match. Let's have a look. She certainly grabbed the spotlight with this victory. It's a big-time opportunity, Byron, as the title will be on the line here. You're right, Michael. And judging from the response on social media heading into this match, we're likely to see a new champ crown here tonight. Time to party with the Prophets. Hey, Corey, let me see your swag. Byron, I didn't think it was possible, but you saying what you just did somehow make Dawkins and Ford less cool. What do you and mean? And these guys are dripping with swag. Can you imagine all three of us walking into a club, cutting a rug or two? I can. Byron, you're humiliating yourself. I hope the street profits don't listen to any of this commentary, Byron, when they watch this show back. Look, I am in with the Street Profits. No, you're that. not, Byron. You're making them less money right now. The Street Profits want nothing to do with you. These two dudes are legit. They're incredibly talented. They're tough. And they know how to have a good time that doesn't involve a bicycle museum. I even feel like dancing. Montez Ford is one of the best-dressed guys in all of sports entertainment. And coming from me, that means something. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall and is for the WWE Tag Team Championship. Introducing the challengers at a combined weight of 439 pounds, Damian Priest and Finn Balor, the Judgment Day. And their opponents at a combined weight
There you see what it's all about. Tag Team Gold. because someone's about to get it from the Street Profits. Montez Ford and Angelo Dawkins, these guys have a resting confidence level on 100. And it's easy to see why. It's been a long time to beat that team with the pure talent and charisma that these guys do. They say some people were made for this industry, and clearly Ford and Dawkins are in that category. And I don't see any reason why we should doubt the champ's ability to retain the titles here tonight. <laughs> with the counter. Series of reversals. Determination there with that kick out. Oh, shot right to the kidney. And again. Great win to tear down your opponent. Finn able to get out of the way. Able to capitalize on. And look at this now. Yes, applying the submission hold. Slips out of the way. To Looking to 
take flight here. From the top. The challenger not looking good right now. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. There he goes, right into the corner. And Finn heads him off at the pass. Oh, flipping the script out of there. Oh, my God. in a second to stay alive there. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. He gets tagged in. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by their special counsel, Paul Heyman, from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! The Beast! The Beast, the Conqueror, the Mayor of Suplex City, Brock Lesnar has earned 
every nickname bestowed upon him. The most decorated combat athlete in the world gracing WWE with his presence. Someone's going to take a trip to Suplex City. Yeah, that's almost guaranteed. Brock Lesnar is ready for a fight. Get ready for the entrance of the Big Dog. I really miss Cole doing that, Saxton. I think I'd do it better. I think it was some par at best. And his opponent, representing the Bloodline from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 265 pounds, Roman Reigns! The head of the table is at the showcase of the Immortals. We've seen Reigns defeat the all-time greats here at WrestleMania. Edge, Triple H, the Undertaker. But there's no bigger win than winning the biggest WrestleMania match in history, unifying the WWE and Universal titles by defeating... Wait, wait, what, what's going on here? Well, he's confused. And I guess he should be. Uh-oh, no! What a malicious attack. This is about getting the edge, not making friends, Saxton. And we're getting dangerously close to the referee calling this match off. These superstars need to come to their senses. I hate to say it, but I think that ship sailed. I have no idea how you stop a fight like this now. Able to get the advantage here. Oh, hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. These two have fought each other many times. What does Lesnar need to do to put the W in his column? Every match between these two is different, but it's ultimately going to come down to whether Lesnar can find that extra gear he can go to. If he can do that, Roman's in trouble. Superstars in the ring, and the referee officially starts the match. Oh, this is the way we're starting, Cole. I think the WWE Universe is in for quite a show tonight.
Lester behind that kickout. Compromised position here. from Brock here. Roman's on the wrong side of this exchange. Lesnar on the wrong side of that exchange. Shot to the midsection connects.
just spilled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tension's really running high now. Uh, yeah, we should probably clear the way, guys. Oh, colliding with a barricade. Oh, he slammed his face right into the barricade. Oh, man, what a headbutt. And more hits up there can leave you dazed. What are you guys thinking? Obviously not about the ref's count, Cole. And he's taking this to the outside now. Can that finish the beast off? And he gets set back into the ring. And giving their fans their money's worth and more. Here is your winner, Roman Reigns. You can tell that the WWE Universe is in shock. Brock Lesnar has been forced to acknowledge Roman Reigns. This was a declaration, Saxton. Suplex City has just been annexed to the island of relevancy.
childhood dream to be on the grandest stage. Well, I don't see the same Bailey who used to write school papers about her dreams in this moment. That's because this Bailey inspires a generation. She is the epitome of ambition, a true role model. Facing perhaps the greatest competitor in women's division history, beating Charlotte will make you a legend. That's a true statement, but it's only true because of how difficult, borderline impossible it is to achieve this task. We are about to bear witness to the queen. Listen, here is a truly generational talent. There's no doubt about that. Well, I think we can all make a very strong argument that Charlotte Flair is Miss WrestleMania. A title the Queen has earned from breaking Asuka's streak to the first ever women's main event, winning the NXT title. There's nothing the Queen can't do on the grandest stage of them all. What a presence. Bailey wants to make an example of this woman. She needs to do everything she can to stop that. She needs to be the absolute best version of herself here tonight. Introducing the challenger from San Jose, California, Bailey. And her opponent from the Queen City, she is the WWE Women's World Heavyweight Champion, Charlotte. With this championship title in play, you can expect this match to be something special. The champion came out here, someone gloating their belt around. Don't know. That's their way of playing mind games. That title should give anyone the right to gloat. Look, what good is it being on top of the mountain if you don't get to look down on everybody else? That is a sad attitude to have. Oh, caught on the chin. Oh, what a stop right to the chest. Are you kidding me? Off the ropes. Brutal knee to the side of the face. Into the corner. This can't be good. And Bailey never saw that coming. Eight feet. And Charlotte displaying this kind of demeanor must be an inherited trait. Nice running crossbody. Into the pin attempt. There's two. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. 
Byron, what's Bailey's strategy to win here tonight? It's all mental. Bailey's got to have that mental confidence that she knows how to stop Charlotte. Maybe, Byron, but believing you can beat the Queen and actually doing it, two different things. But the point there, Corey, is that Bailey has beaten Charlotte before. That can play big in this match tonight. Well, Charlotte just needs to have her type of match right now. Charlotte knows she is comfortable in big matches. Any match against her fellow horsewomen is a big match, and Charlotte excels here. Nothing Charlotte loves more than to gloat and say, I told you so. And she'll back it up soon enough. Knee drop. So hopefully, this will be a short trip outside. Lock applied. Nice suplex. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Saw that one coming. The champ's taking an immense amount of damage. Not what you want to see by any means. Charlotte needs to utilize some of that famous flare stamina to get back in this. I agree with you. It's gonna happen. What? Taken out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Trademark top and natural selection. The title is going nowhere. Chase your dreams. Good night. But only two. Simply refusing to let this opportunity slip away. And who knows if there'll be another shot? Yet you can't give up. Oh, forget about paying in the WWE Universe. That should keep her in the game. Bay looking to pull the curtains on Charlotte. Get connected. Display of stamina. The champ showing they're truly worthy of this title. But 
things might only get harder from here. And now there must be a level of annoyance in Bailey. Annoyed that it did result in a three count. Got the underhook. Nice standing backbreaker and takedown. How do Bailey and Charlotte continue to get up? Uh, adrenaline? The desire? I mean, it's all you can credit. She's able to get out of the way. Catches the kick. Oh, elbow to the knee. Oh, hyper extended leg. This is one matchup that lived up to its billing, and then some. Here is your winner, and new WWE Women's World Heavyweight Champion, chapter and this title's legacy begins here. We really are looking at a new era. Just a prelude to the unrelenting attack we are about to see from Karrion Cross.
Just unfathomable dangers dwell within Bray Wyatt. And it seems as though Bray has slowly been losing the battle to contain that danger. Yeah, that's a frightening thought for the entire WWE Universe, including Wyatt himself. You can feel the anticipation here as Bray Wyatt commands the WWE Universe. A man who always succeeds in unnerving his opponents. about to unleash his true viciousness. I'm kind of scared to watch. And introducing the champion from Sheryls Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds. He is the World Heavyweight Champion, Braun Strowman! The champ comes into his title defense incredibly confident, Corey. And with good reason, Cole. When you're the champ, you don't have to worry about winning. You just have to make sure you don't lose. That is the champion's advantage. Many have written him off as champion, but he is determined to prove his doubters wrong. Triple threat match now underway. No telling how this is going to go. Temporary alliances, sneak attacks, and all out brawl. Place your bets now, gentlemen. Anything and everything is on the table. A repeated forearm to the face. Goodness. He's got him scouted. Boot. 
He avoids the damage. Here's the pump handle. The suplex launched. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Delivered into the barricade. Oh, God. Ooh. Oh, Wyatt, full ass speed. Counter. And now there's an opening. Oh, what a chunk slam. Toss them across the ring. Oh, that hurt. Lands the elbow. 
Danger is constantly lurking in a no disqualification match. Interference has to be a concern for these superstars. While it certainly can be a factor, I don't think it should be a concern. The only thing you should be concerned about is getting whipped. Careful, you don't want to be the weak link in triple threat. The sick, sadistic cross finding a movement in all of this. Just one right after the other can't be stopped. Draped upside down in a tree of woe. Wyatt turns the tables. Away, living the 
might fight another day. He's taking this to the floor now. I don't know what they're looking for here. If you're going to grab a kendo stick, you better be prepared to use it. Gave everyone their money's worth. Here's another look. Here is your winner and new world heavyweight champion, Bray Wyatt. What a tremendous effort from all three superstars involved in this hard hitting triple threat. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing.